Hello everyone and welcome to the Foundry Solo HM. So we're doing the Foundry in hard mode, solo with our level 60 Merc. So the Foundry is located here, um, here on the White Nova, on the Empire. It is an Empire only flashpoint. Again, we're just going to make sure it's set to hard mode before we go in. Make sure we got hard Foundry. So it is right here on the white nova it is the one on the left uh, you do have to talk to this npc here you just talk to her and make sure you set it to hard mode and we'll head on in so why would you want to do this well uh, if you're doing your hk51 quest then you gotta get a part uh, from Revan and it can only be obtained by doing hard mode so we're gonna do this solo it should be uh, fairly easy I haven't actually attempted this I just realized I'm in the wrong stance better get the high velocity gas cylinder and we'll head on in and find it I was healing here I was healing I healed ravagers uh, yesterday in a pug group so uh, that's why I was in healer stance so, but I got my DPS set on and our DPS uh, set up and let's get on with it Okay, I skipped ahead a little bit, uh, basically because it's just a cutscene that you do. Basically, you head in to the bridge, you talk to this guy. You start here, and you talk. You head into the bridge, talk to a guy, do a cutscene, and then the flashpoint starts. It's just a lot of running and a lot of cutscenes. It's not really necessary for this. Now, the first pool we are going to try and skip. Doesn't look it's gonna, like it's going to be possible. This might be a pain. I'm gonna get as many of these sergeants down as possible. Why did that go off? Nah, we're not even getting hit. There you go, didn't even get hit. 2% damage. So most of this trash we are gonna skip and most of We'll skip as much as we can skip. We can skip this lot that we can. Oh, damn it. Well, HK finished it off for me. I don't have it. I should point out I don't have HK in uh, the 192 gear. Uh, he does have a couple of 192 PCs, but most of his gear is like 178, and it's mostly we'll aim gear. So we'll try and skip as much trash as we can skip, and uh, we'll join you at the first boss. Okay, so this is the first boss, the Foundry Guardian. Uh, pretty easy. It was pretty easy back in the day. It's just a tank and spank fight. There's nothing... Nothing that really goes on here that is going to cause us any problems, so let's just pull it and get on with it. As you can see there's nothing that's really, it's not even hurting us to be honest. Yeah, we're taking no damage. This boss should be no real problem. And down it goes. Always a really easy boss, this one. This is never going to cause anyone any problems. What have we got? Black coal bolt blasters thing. There we go. We're not doing the bonus quest because I don't see the point in it, to be honest. People ask why I don't do the bonus quest for these. I just don't see the point, personally. Uh, the trash, there's nothing to worry about on the trash. Trash doesn't cause you any damage. So we'll just head into this cutscene. And we'll join at the second boss, which is the most interesting boss of this whole encounter. And the uh, most troublesome, really. Ooh. I'll avoid these guys. If possible, there we go, we avoided them. Alright, so we've made it to HK47. Now this boss can be a little bit tricky. Also, it's a pretty cool cutscene. I wonder if HK51 gets any lines here. Let's find out, shall we? 
See if he says anything about our companion. Assessment. You have been exceedingly sporting during our hunt. I am HK-47, the Master's most faithful ally. Once a mere assassin droid, it is now my burden and joy to command the Foundry's mechanical armies. It's time to turn over the extermination units. Rejection. I would not advise taking control, given their current program. The extermination droids are my Master's crowning achievement. They are equipped with bioscanners capable of detecting Sith genetic material. Any organics with Sith ancestry will be slaughtered. This includes 97.8% of the Imperial population. So, when you wipe out half the galaxy, I'll be one of the survivors. Commentary. Unfortunately for you, the Master still wants you dead. Your bones will make excellent trophies to commemorate my return to assassination. Right, I don't like that bug with his mouth and that headpiece, that's quite annoying. Prejudice set to maximum. Oh no, he set his prejudice to maximum, right. Couple of things to explain here. Uh, he will go into this little, uh, what could we call it? We'll call it a chamber. He goes into this little chamber, there will be four clickable things. You can see on these little uh, arm things that are sticking out, there's four of them. Uh, we are going to have to click them or he will hit a mini in rage. Uh, there used to be a bug where you could just leave the room and he wouldn't ever go back into them. There will be ads spawning from these two chambers right here. Uh, we can just ignore them. Uh, they shouldn't do too much damage to us, but however his uh, snipe damage does do quite a lot of damage. I don't know how much it will do to us at 60. I've never done this before, but let's go and find out, shall we? Let's pull him and get on with it. That's the only real thing. Yeah, it's two adds. Uh, what you could do is if you could kite them down and you could push them off the edge there if you were struggling for DPS, but it shouldn't be a problem. Uh, we could just send our companion to hit them. We could send HK-51. So let's uh, kill HK-47. Uh, we should point out that this boss again... What's his title? I've never seen it. Reconstructed Assassination Droid is his title. So right, um, a lot harder than we did in uh, the False Emperor. So let's get him pulled and see what happens. Yeah, powerful shot, what's it going to do to us? Nothing. Did absolutely nothing to us. Yeah, those droids aren't doing any damage. Whoa, what the? Cannot see target. I might have to kill them, actually. Extermination units. Convert. Right, he does, oh, he does that as well. He disappears. Doesn't he in hard mode? Right, so the thing's about to come down. That's why we can't see him. Oh, that's a circle thing. This is new. Right, now we have to do the clicking phase. This is where it might get difficult because if you go, you have a certain time limit to do this. Stop shooting him, HK51. Right, we're gonna get it in the time. Did we get his mini in rage? Wait for him to come back out. Yeah, we can damage him. We should kill him, no problem. Go chase him. Where'd he go? There he is, there. Ah, oh, don't tell me he's bugging. I have to hit him with area attack. Oh, he has bugged. Yep, he's bugged out. Yep, he has done the bug, and he is hitting rage, he, we have got his soft and rage because he's doing damage to us. There you go, he died. Does that quite a lot, I think if you have too much damage on him. Because he used to do that way back when. But luckily we had enough damage on him to kill him before we hit in rage. Ooh, uh, campaign relic. 
What do we get? Damaging attacks have a 30% chance to deal 187 internal damage to the target. Wow, 187. Right, there we go. Quite an easy boss, really, now. It used to be quite difficult because he used to hit you very hard. But you can just ignore the ads. Uh, they don't do anything to you. If the ads are hitting you, you just kill the ads. Uh, I don't know what happened to him when he went into that phase for the final time. It didn't come up with the clickables. I think it's because we are damaging him too fast. I think mean, just too much DPS now for this fight. I guess I'm not even that well geared as a level 60 as well. But we're doing. Can we sneak past this guy? Yeah, we can. Right, so we're gonna go to Revan now, which is the final boss. I think we can sneak past all these guys. Yeah, there we go. We can use our mount here as well. Uh, for this part, you just wanna the asteroid part. We just wanna travel down this side, right here, and just avoid all of the trash. Uh, we're not gonna do the bonus boss. Basically, you click those two things, and a giant worm will appear. Uh, the only tactics for that is stay out of the spit. I think the spit will still cause you damage at level 60, though. So I would just stay out of it. Just kite him around. Uh, it's pretty easy, really. Uh, but we're not going to do that. Using the system we're just going to go and... You, you can skip control. a bunch of trash in here. We'll just keep this going. Oh, couldn't skip that. Did that automatically pull them? That's trash is not really going to be an issue for us. Save a barrage prop. As well, grab what do we get? A crappy helmet. So again, if you jump up here, you can skip a lot of this trash. You can just jump up here and move along. Uh, the elite droids fairly easy. Uh, there will be Jedi that come up here. What you do is just pop your speed boost, and you can just run right past them because you only aggro them when they become into position. And again, you can skip this trash as well just by jumping up here. Just jump on here, and then you can jump along the side and just run along here. Again, you can skip another bunch of trash at this point right here. What you're going to do is you're going to jump to this little circle thing right here. This little pillar. You're just going to jump here. If you mess this up, you just pop a speed boost and run. We didn't mess it up. So we're just going to fall down here and there's going to be a bunch of Jedi. Uh, they don't aggro until they stop, basically. Uh, also, there's another little uh, mini boss here that you can kill. You can kill him if you want. He doesn't really offer anything decent, we'll just kill him. That's a thing here that can be cleansed. If you really want to cleanse it. Out of that. And he's down already. What did he drop? He drops a blue weapon, a couple of comms, and a bit more credits for us. Let's use that proc to heal ourselves. Right, so we're just going to make our way towards Revan now. Pretty easy boss, pretty disappointing. You could easily solo this at 55. I don't think we can skip past these guys if we pop our boost in right. Yeah, we can. Again, just go up here and just run along. Use that little skipping technique. And we are at Revan. Now... He doesn't really do a lot, this boss. Quite a disappointment, really, for the first time that we fought this guy. The uh, first time I ever fought him was HM as well. And that HK unit you destroyed. You waited loyally for 300 years. Hey, Revan, don't go mad rebuild, or anything. But it won't be the same. Can't you see you're on the wrong side? The Emperor is dead. For you, for me, for the galaxy. I'm not on anyone's side. I take a job and I see it through. And turn a blind eye to the consequences. I understand. No, oh, I don't Jedi, turn a blind eye to the war. credit. I accepted violence and darkness, and the Emperor called to me from across the galaxy. He made me a Sith Lord and named me Darth Revan. I killed for him. I turned on the Republic. But I have found redemption. On Drummond Kaas, there was a cult founded in your honor. So I've heard. Not what I would have wanted, given the things I did. I nearly destroyed the Republic, and that nearly destroyed me. When the Jedi returned me to the light, my memory was shattered. It took me years to track and confront right, the Emperor. Right, so what again. we are going to do here I is... I tried to end him, 
we are going to keep him in the middle. What we want to do is keep him in the middle, uh, and uh, I think it's force in balance is what we're going to interrupt. Can't remember what it's called. It is a big channel thing. Now we will get stunned. We will get pushed around in this fight. That's the only thing he really does. He doesn't really do much in the way of damage. He was quite easy back in the day. Uh, even now, it was quite easy. So we're just uh, we're just explaining this because as soon as I come out of this cutscene, we are going to go into a fight uh, with Revan. Uh, to just uh, stay in the middle or you, so you don't get knocked off. There's a few circles that you need to avoid as well. Purple circles on the ground to avoid. Other than that, he's pretty easy. What am I supposed to learn from all this? I want you to know we're enemies for a reason. All those years in his prison, I could feel him in my mind, drawing on my connection to the Force. But I was in his mind too, fighting him. Only I've been both Jedi and Sith, and found clarity in the Force. Only I understand him, and his death is my responsibility. Still got the mask in his hand. This isn't clarity, and it isn't your responsibility. There's another path. There was a time, a moment, when my destiny wasn't certain. But that moment is gone. I've saved the Republic twice before. I've fought Mandalores and armies of the dark side. You won't stop me. Stay in the middle. Uh, best have your back to the console. Bit of a pain miss for this spec. There it is. It's power of the force actually you gotta interrupt. And there we go, we got pushed back. You see how far back we got pushed and he's been stunned. It's not really an issue. He does his little master strike thing. Just pull him back in here. Okay, get back here. Ah, oh, we're rooted again. Take that off. I will cover you, master. Oh no, no, don't. Make sure we interrupt that. They'll tell you that Revan has begun to channel the force to become more powerful. Just interrupt that. As you can see, you're taking no damage. Use that off the block there, but who cares? Lines up quite nicely. Never fought anyone like me. I was I am Oh, it failed because we turn them around and get out of that fourth storm. Get out of there, HK. I will cover you, master. Never fought anyone like me. I was sick. I am. There we go. We're getting that other phase now. Just gonna move around a little bit so that we don't get hit. Luckily, we are Arsenal for this. There we go, we beat him, we got him down to 4% that's and that's it. Me. I am nothing. Leave him alone, HK. No, I know you're just bullying him. There we go. Oh. <laughs> we got the achievement. You have completed all the hard mode flashpoints. What? We hadn't done that before? I've done this hundreds of times. Defeat the Jedi Prisoner hard mode. Foundry Finisher hard mode. Clear. Uh, there's also a uh, title that you can get in this one. I'm just going to see if we can find it right now. Haha, <laughs> grats on all the achievement. Yeah, um, I've already done all these. <laughs> there you go, HM. I've done all the HM flashpoints. I've got the mounts and everything from them. Well, it must have been a bugged one. 
Defeat the Jedi prisoner, hard mode, finish, foundry finisher. Defeat all of them in the foundry. Uh, Flashpoint master we also got. Uh, that's a, what else did we get? Elite foundry finisher. Defeat all the bosses in the foundry 25 times on hard mode. Yeah, surprised that we got them. We just got a bunch of achievements there. We also got our 10k credits. Hmm, that's a strange one. Right, we're going to look at the other achievement that you can farm for this one. Um, basically, I'm going to have to go find it now. Um, where is Foundry? Black Talon, now oh, there it is at the bottom. Uh, so basically, you can get the... Uh, where is it? Oh, we got the uh, the trophy as well. Uh, you get the uh, Revan HM trophy. I'm trying to find the the meat bag title. Did we already? Uh, basically, it was defeat HK forty seven. I think you defeat him. What is it? Twenty five times. I can't remember where it is. It doesn't seem to have it here. Defeat HK47 in hard mode. Defeat HK47. We've done it five times. We've done this uh, 1 out of 10. We've done it already. Uh, yeah, strange. We've done Revan hundreds of times. Elite Foundry Finisher. We've got that and we got the decoration for Revan HM. Defeat the Guardians. Defeat the Exterminator Droid. The Burrower we've done once, I think. Um, I can't... Um, maybe it's under... The Flashpoints, wherever. Scroll up and find this thing. Maybe it's under Flashpoint. Uh, the Foundry... There was the uh, the meat bag title, which was defeat HK fifty one HK forty seven, um, but that doesn't seem defeat the foundry assassin droid. I can't remember what it was now. It's not under story. It's not under events. Um, it's not a PVP one. Wow, we haven't done any any of the companions on the Imperial Agent. Hmm, I can't find... Have they taken that out of the game now? It seems because it used to be under Foundry. And you would get the Meatbag title if you did HK... I can't find it anyway, I can't find it anyway. <laughs> That's interesting. You used to get the... Defeat HK, I think it was defeat um, HK51. Ooh, black hole med tech helmet. That's kind of ugly looking. Right, so that was Foundry HM. All you gotta do is do a cutscene here. And that's it. That was all for this little run. Uh, again, no problems. Uh, this is a 186 with the odd 192 piece geared uh, Merc. Not that hard to be honest with you. Alright. Right, so that was all for this video. Thank you for joining me. Uh, next time we'll take a look at Maelstrom Prison, uh, which is a bit in, a bit more, um, bit longer than this one. This one's only a couple of bosses. Uh, so thank you for joining me, and I'll see you again soon. And goodbye.